18 years ago, this country was burning. Rwanda burned on the news, and it burned its way into the history books. It lasted 100 days, and this place burned to the ground. When it was all over, there was an important decision to make. What do you do in a country where so many were guilty? Only the most absurd options remained. Reconciliation. Grace. Forgiveness. So quietly, with almost nobody watching, the country began to heal. It started small, with new rules that replaced chaos with order. There were fines for littering, fines for talking on cell phones while driving, fines for being shoeless in a public place. And although violations cost up to a month's salary, these rules had a deeper meaning. They helped restore a lost dignity. Proud surroundings made proud citizens. But the country still needed roads, more schools, power lines to connect small towns, and most importantly, the people of Rwanda needed clean water. Rwanda is made of mountains, and hauling water here is backbreaking work. People spend hours fetching water from rivers and streams, walking for miles over steep, narrow paths. And the water they bring home it's not even clean. Every morning, kids are late to school, collecting water they know will make them sick. Determined to make changes, the government called in experts to help. And that's where our local partner came in. Water for People has a vision, and they call it Everyone Forever. It's a simple idea, but to execute it will take incredible determination. Everyone means not leaving a place until the elderly, the sick, the disabled, literally everyone has access to clean water. Forever means the systems are built to last, managed by locals who can maintain them long after we're gone. After three years of planning, complex hydrology reports, and hundreds of meetings, it's time to get to work. To see all of Rwanda get clean water, we need to start somewhere. The government is contributing its own money towards the project, but $1.7 million is still needed. And that's where we come in. Rwanda's come a long way in 18 years, but right now, people here are still walking for dirty water. So this September, we need your help to change that. Because water changes everything. Join us.